Digital Books topple paper, Microsoft launches Google Earth competitor, and Yellow River oil spill. This is Planet 100. Welcome to Planet 100, the top environmental news stories of the day in 100 seconds or less. I'm Sarah Backhouse and it's Monday, January 4th. According to online retailer Amazon.com, December 25th, 2009 was the historic day digital books outsold their paper counterparts. The company also reports that the Kindle was the most gifted item in Amazon's history. So given the likelihood that owners of the new e-reader would spend Christmas Day downloading e-books, this might account for the somewhat inflated figure for digital book sales. Regardless, it's safe to assume the digital revolution in books is underway. Good news for forests, bad news for landfills. Move over Google Earth, here comes Microsoft with an environmental atlas of Europe that aims to change the way we understand and visualise climate change. Launched at the UN Climate Summit in Copenhagen, the Atlas uses satellite images to highlight the impact climate change has on the environment, from diminishing reindeer herds in Finland to plankton blooms off the coast of Ireland. The interactive map also features eyewitness video accounts of climate change across Europe, as well as examples of positive actions taken by governments, communities and individuals. And finally, breaking news, an oil pipeline in China ruptured and spilled 40,000 gallons of diesel into the Yellow River, threatening water supplies for millions of people in the Henan province. And that's the Planet 100. We'll see you tomorrow for more breaking news.